Hey, today we're going to be checking out the Borka Tools PTL062 IP kit made for the FNH SCAR for barrel changes and torquing your barrel back on or changing barrels out. The 62 inch pound rating meets FNH's specifications for torquing and each one of the kits comes with a carrying case, the ratchet, and the torque limiter and a T25 Torx bit. The torque limiter has its own indivi individual serial number and that corresponds with the certificate of calibration to let you know that this thing is 62 inch pounds. And the ratchet handy features is that it can be just thumb ratcheted for tightening on screws and the T25 bits can also fit into there for tightening or loosening screws also. So we're going to go ahead and do a barrel change or just loosen it up and then we'll tighten it back on again just to give you an idea if you haven't done it before what it involves. So we'll go ahead and start by taking this out and we'll just pop it into here. You can loosen the barrel from either side and the screws are held captive so they won't fall out. Just keep going until they're actually loose. The barrel torque screws. Orca Tools also makes a 65 inch torque limiter that, uh, that I have used on this barrel before. Works fantastic. Close enough to 62 inch pounds for me, but he wanted to put out a product that was made scar specific. Website. It's borkatools.com and they also make other torque limiters and torque products for scope rings and basically anything you would need for your rifle. Rifle or gun smithing. So basically, once it's loose, this should slide forward. Oh, we're not loose. Let's check it again. Should be there. There it goes. So you just slide it forward. There's a little notch out in here, and that just slides right out. So this is your barreled assembly. If you haven't pulled one out, that's about what it looks like. So to install it, what we're going to do is we're going to slide it into the notch here again. Pull. Make sure you go all the way back because you can get hung up on the screws if these are pushed down. So we're sliding all the way back just like that. And then I'm going to just uh, start Actually, let's go ahead and swap this out real quick. Put it on the torque limiter, it's a little bit easier. Again, make sure you're back. It's going to start on the sticker side. Everybody that has a scar knows about the stickers. And basically, we're just going to get these to the point where they're snugged up. You can hear it start sucking up. I'm not going to tighten them, I'm just going to get them snug. side, opposite side of the rifle, come back to the one in front of it on the sticker side, snug it up a little bit, go to the opposite side, there is a pretty good video on YouTube from FNH on torquing your barreled action in the direction, now we head to the front on the sticker 
paper side. Just lightly snug that up. torque it. So you'll hear an audible click when this thing reaches its 62 inch pounds on the limiter. And again on the sticker side, there it is. Go to the opposite side, rear screw. There we are. Sticker side again, front screw. There we are. And all the way to the front screw. Sit side, sticker side again, and we'll finish up on the non-sticker side. There we go. Your barrel is torqued to 62 inch pounds. Meets the specifications for FNH scars, 16 or scar 17s. And again, this is the kit. Certificate of off or sorry, certificate of calibration. Got the torque limiter, torx bit ratchet wrench, carry pouch. This is what uh, their 65 inch pound kit consists of. Again, separate kit. Check out borkatools.com. And hope that helps any of you with your barrel changes and torques. If you have any questions, just ask.